burying me could have been burying my kids. Anthony Jefferson could never imagine being put in this position. Life or death for his children meant using his own body to shield them from gunfire. I wasn't even expecting that. So like I did, I just went into to daddy mode. I just thank God that we still alive. This dramatic surveillance video shows how Jefferson scooped up his three youngest children, then dove on top of them as three gunmen fired shots inside on the road automotive in the Eastchester section of the Bronx last month. They was just crying. They were scared. They were scared. Jefferson and his children, ages six, five, and two, were there trying to buy his wife a new car for her birthday. We was watching TV, so once I heard the pop and the, the glass shattered, I just got them and got down. It was a split-second decision this 39-year-old father says he would do over again. It could have been you. It could have been anybody. I would have did the same thing. Right now, he can't walk, recovering from a gunshot wound to his thigh. The bullet is still lodged in his leg, but his biggest concern is how the shooting has affected his children. My kids, you know, they my heroes. You know, they call me a hero, but they my hero. Police believe the gunmen were trying to settle a gang-related beef. Instead, they put innocent lives in danger. While Jefferson counts his blessings, he sends this message to anyone who picks up a gun. Y'all gotta be mindful. Stop. Stop the shooting. Stop. Just put down the guns. That's it. Jefferson is also thanking the community for support, and he asked us to clear up one thing. It's been reported that because he was shot, he lost his two jobs. He says that's not the case. He was laid off during the pandemic. And now, because he is still recovering, he's not sure if or when he can get back to work. Nicole Johnson, Pix11 News.